So I chose to study smart and sustainable cities here at Trinity because I'm really passionate about the intersection of communication and sustainability. And I think that is where the, the future of sustainability lies. And I think working with cities to communicate to the public and exploring my passion in sustainability while also gathering new skills to study like some engineering and computer science is a great way to just move forward with all of that. Some of the elements that I enjoy from studying smart and sustainable cities is that it's usually when people think of that program, they automatically assume that it's like tech or people just who have had that background can get into it. Um, but I also believe that to, to make a smart and sustainable city, you also have to think about the people. My fellow students and I really enjoy each other and we study together, we will get lunch together and head back at the end of the day, but it's a really cohesive group that really wants to work together to kind of like co-teach each other and pursue all of these new topics that we're studying. I really enjoy the small class sizes and really getting to work with the professors and the topics that they're extremely well, not like well versed in. And I'm really enjoying like some problem based learning that we're doing in my urban governance class. I'm enjoying the engineering courses, which are definitely challenging, but it's so exciting to be able to learn something and add a new like skill to my tool belt of things I can use. And I really just enjoy the vibe on campus because everyone here is really excited to be in this program and to be learning. I think especially after the past year where kind of the world felt on hold, it really is productive and inspiring to be around people like working to make change again. My favorite module is our urban governance module, which is with our course director, Dr. Philip Lawton. And I really enjoy the, the problem-based learning and how we are all collaborating and, and reading and working in these small groups to create a discussion and solutions about what we are studying. And I really like how he's bringing in diverse perspectives from all over the country and the world. I would essentially would want to work in community organizations or maybe a nonprofit um, as a consultant maybe in smart and sustainable cities but um, because we take a couple of classes from three different departments so we take from the engineering we take from the natural science and we also take from the geography department there's an array of things that you can do like um, you can work at a at a startup you can work um, in transportation to help design um, the new roads and stuff you can do like community organizing, you can do um, consulting, you can do, you can do a lot of things. I feel like it's, it's one of the programs that I thought didn't really have like a set like, oh, okay, so this is what you're gonna do afterwards. Like, I think that there are a lot of options that you can choose from after you graduate. After I uh, complete the Smart and Sustainable Cities course here, I am hoping to go into the realm of environmental consulting. That's where I'm very interested in communicating sustainability and environmental sustainability to the public, whether it's the private sector, the public sector, or city planners. I think that intersection is the most crucial area of sustainability now, and I think it's where people like us who will graduate from this program can go out and actually make a difference in how like the future is developed in cities and in companies. What I think is really great about the Smart and Sustainable Cities program is it, it is just that. It's smart cities and sustainable cities. So if you have engineers or computer science majors who have that background coming into this program, there is a direct track to go out and work in those fields. In, in coding, in computer science, working to create the smart city of the future. But there's also the ability to be more on the sustainability, the human impact side of it, where you can work with people within their cities and make sure that the smart city works for them. And I think both of those tracks are what's gonna make this program successful for putting students out into the world. So advice for prospective students would be like, don't like beat yourself up too much. You apply to whatever it is that interests you the most. I feel like this is something that I never thought I would be able to do because I chose psychology. And I just assumed that I was gonna go through the psychology like route and be like a psychologist or a social worker. And having the opportunity to change gears real quick is, is something that I didn't think was possible, but it is. So just, you know, don't question yourself. <laughs> You'll be fine or grand, as the kids say. <laughs>